Huh? You want to call the police on him for having a barbecue on a and Sunday? You're going to feel free! Back off! I'm going to tell them there's an African American man threatening my life. Let's get a video. Of, Let's take a picture of you too. Dude, we got a my I'm first Karen. Picture of you too. Literally walked into my house. I know I'm walking to your house. It's amazing. I know it is amazing. <laughs> and we're gonna report you. I'm not gonna report this to the to the owner hey, feel because free. this is too much. You guys do this all the time. Feel free. So if you don't want people to come in, don't write entrance. Why do you hate music so much? Floor. Because you guys have been doing this all the time. Hey, you know, you could have just knocked on the door, rang the doorbell, we would have turned it oh, off. Oh, no, 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 we did. We did. You guys didn't hear it. And that was the direction you chose to take this. Thank well, you. It have is a great night. You chose to take it. What's your name? Which house is yours, Miss Trespasser? <laughs> Maybe I should follow her to her house. <clears throat> Let's see which lady this is. BMW. Ooh! She's got a beamer, we can get the plates. Let's see. Got him. There you have it. This Karen trespasses into a black neighbor's home. A white woman in Lululemon pants, I'm sure of it. And that's why she can do this, right? That's why she's entitled to do this. We'll give you more. It occurred earlier this week in California, okay? That's where she is. The poster of the clip provided more info in the comments. Me and my friends were having a small rooftop concert, he wrote. We notified all our surrounding neighbors, including her, that it would be over by 10. It was not 10. Yet she thought it was acceptable to trespass on our property and walk through our whole house to get to our rooftop and began to threaten us, okay? This is what the person who posted this, Deshwandin, had to say. Also noting that the woman threatened to call the police on him and his friend. She was extremely hostile, he continued, threatening to call the police, etc. And a black star with the details here. Let's give you another shot of this, this Karen, okay? She looks the part, she is here to do some damage and issue threats. I just, I mentioned Lululemon, I don't know why, because they're not part of this, Ravana. But I just have in my mind, I know this, Karen, and so do you. And she has others, they've multiplied, they're everywhere, not just California. To think that they can, I don't know if California is a stand your ground state, but I don't know that Karen would care because nothing's gonna happen to her. Can you fill this out? I mean, she broke the law. She <laughs> trespassed into their house. Thank and you. I think and it, it you don't have to intend to trespass. You just have to know what you're what you're doing to for it to be trespassed. But she even goes further and she says, I know I'm trespassing. I know <laughs> I walked right up in your house as if she has the right to do it. And I'm sure she wouldn't treat a white neighbor like this. But I'll also say the fact that she had to get in her car and drive to wherever she lives, she's not right next door. Mm -hmm. She's not the house uh. immediately next door. She's just somewhere within the neighborhood. So I can't imagine it was that loud for her. But I mean, they the 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 people who were trespassed against, you know, went out of their way. They informed the neighborhood we're gonna be doing this. And why can't they have a little fun? On their property, with proper notice to everyone in the neighborhood. I mean, within, you know, most cities have ordinances about how much noise you can make before a certain time, and most of those those ordinances say 10 or 11 is the cutoff, um, depending on if it's a weekday or a weekend. So they were violating any law. She wouldn't have the right to call the police if she called the police. You know, theoretically, the only person that they should be able to arrest is her. But you know, if she did call them, that's not how it would play out because she's the victimized white woman. Uh, and <laughs> those are her scary black neighbors who were playing music. Uh, I am smiling because this is why we love you. I want you to have your own show. But I don't know that you will have time having just graduated <laughs> law school. And what I heard and what you just delivered was an opening statement. Okay, cross examination, right? You drove away and you're, I heard it, and your BMW, so how close were you really? Was this really bothering you? And then I heard the best closing argument, okay? You're right, she broke the law. And I think there should be 
a penalty. And I also, Ravana, give kudos to this black neighbor who <laughs> kept his cool and just simply followed her to distance because next mm -hmm. it'll be he's stalking her and he was running after her with God knows what. His blackness is just the weapon enough. But I think there needs to be a penalty for these Karens. Now you're coming in the crib? Really? Right. I will say quickly, I had a Karen roommate once, worst person oh, I ever wow. lived with. And it was 7 p.m. on a Friday and our upstairs neighbors were playing music loudly, but it was 7 p.m. on a weekend. And she left a note, I didn't know she did this, left a note <laughs> on their door saying, please keep it down in the future. And they came down one day and I opened the door and they said, did you leave this? And I was like, "Oh my God, I swear it wasn't <laughs> me. And he was like, well, we'll tell your neighbor that she can't come to our next party. <laughs> But wow. you are invited. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. And just to be clear, and I don't know if you're coming to us from home today, but you know, long, please tell me, you no, no longer reside. Thank, thank because God. it's dangerous by its guilt by association. And, you know, had it gone another way, who knows?